Hello my loves, welcome back to my channel and to my latest Motivation Monday, here to get you motivated for the week. In today's video, I'm gonna be cleaning my family bathroom, which I've been dying to clean for a couple of weeks now since having surgery. And I'm also gonna be sharing some brand new Amazon finds for the bathroom. So first of all, I'm gonna start by just decluttering and getting everything off the floor. I'm gonna take away the bath mat as well and get that washed. And now the first area that I'm going to clean is going to be the sink. So I'm just gonna spray it with a flash bathroom spray and I'm gonna get a clean microfiber cloth and I'm gonna wipe down the surface of the sink. Then I will work on the tap and also on the plug hole cover, I will unscrew it and I will clean that as well. I'm just gonna spray the plug cover with a little bit of the flash spray and go over it with my sonic scrubber just to get off any of those watermarks that love to cling to these things. <laughs> and I'll also use my sonic scrubber just to go around the rim of the plug hole as well and make sure any marks there have been removed. Now that the sink is all clean, I can pop back the soap dispenser and the boys' toothbrushes and I'll give those a little wipe down too. Next up, I'm going to clean the toilet. I've been using this Domestos Power Foam and I absolutely love it. It smells great and I think it cleans really thoroughly and it goes really far as well. I'm using a blue microfiber cloth to do this and I'm just gonna start by cleaning the outside of the toilet and then I'll lift up each of the lids and do each layer as I go. I'm also gonna use the Domestos Power Foam on my little silicone cleaning brush. I'm just gonna cover it like this and I'm gonna use it to get between the cracks. Because my toilet seat cover doesn't remove, this brush is perfect for making sure that you're cleaning really thoroughly between all of those gaps. And this is also the first Amazon find. So I have linked that lovely little silicone toilet brush in the description box below. That is the first Amazon find that I have showed you in the video. Now that I've put toilet gel down the toilet, I'm just gonna balance the toilet brush here for a minute to let it dry, and I'm gonna spray the toilet and the brush with some disinfectant spray as well. Next up, I'm just gonna empty the waste paper bin. I'm just gonna put all of the rubbish into the bag here and empty the bin. Then I'm gonna clear these shelves. One of these baskets has toilet rolls in it, or it should have toilet rolls in it, and if, if I remember to buy any. And the other one has spare sort of bath bubbles and things. I've removed the baskets, and I'm just gonna use the clean cloth and the same bathroom surface spray just to wipe down all the surfaces here and get rid of any grime or any dust. once it's done I will just pop the baskets back like I said I forgot to buy toilet roll my bad <laughs> really need to get some and now I'm gonna move on to the bath and the first thing I need to do is clear all of the toys this takes forever we have way too many bath toys I really need to sort through these I keep them just in this little basket by the bath so I'm just gonna tidy them all away the into the basket and I'll also remove all of the non-slip stickers that we keep on the bottom of the bath I'll just peel them all off and stick them on the side to drain. I'm going to use the Domestos Power Foam again because I just love it and a nice clean cloth and I'm just going to wipe down every surface of the bath making sure that I've got on any grime that's sticking on there or any dust that likes to gather around the sides like this and just leaving it nice and shiny and clean. Now 
I've moved on to the shower and I just want to work on the outside of the shower because this is where the dust and the sort of lint and <laughs> bits that come off the towel love to gather as you can see here all of this dark sort of dusty fabricy linty stuff so I've just wiped down the sides and I just want to go over them with this cloth just to gather it all and to make it nice and clean and shiny and fresh Now for the inside of the shower, I'm just using scrub daddy and I'm using dish soap and I'm just gonna go over. I find this is the simplest and best way to get rid of that soap scum. I'm just gonna go over it a few times, making sure I've worked on all that soap scum. And then I just wash it off with the shower head. It is so quick, so easy. And like I say, I find that it really, really gets rid of those horrible soapy marks. I'm gonna use my Beldre spray mop just to do the floors before I finish as well. This is the quickest and easiest way to clean the bathroom floors. I love a good spray mop. And I'm gonna put a fresh little Febreze bathroom. What are these called? Like the little things where you press the button on the back and you pop it in the bathroom anyway. They always smell amazing. And onto my next Amazon find, I'm just gonna hang a fresh towel onto my towel rail. If you don't have a towel rail and you just have a radiator like me, you can buy this extendable towel rail and it literally clips onto the radiator and you can neatly hang and dry your towels. My next Amazon find are these hanging baskets. I love to put a couple of them on the wall in the bathroom with some artificial greenery and it just really brightens up the room. You could put anything you want in these baskets, but I love to have a bit of green in the bathroom. So I've linked these baskets in the description box as I have with all of my other Amazon finds as well. This one is probably my favorite. This toilet roll holder has a little bit of a hidden secret. It is also a storage box and it's so handy to have right next to the toilet because you can put things like toilet wipes, which my son needs to use. And you can also put tampons and things in there as well. It's a really handy little storage space to have right next to the toilet and it looks really smart as well. So technically this clear shelf that you're gonna see me pop next to the bath is actually from B&M, but the bottles that you're gonna see me put into it are from Amazon. They are plain pump bottles that you can get in lots of colors and you can label them however you like. You'll see them in just a sec, but I have linked them and everything else in the description box below. I hope you enjoyed my latest video. Don't forget to subscribe before you go. Here are the bottles <laughs> and I'll see you in my next video.